Hey y'all, it's Lady Sick in the place to be. Lady C's hauls and all. Lady C's hauls and all. And I know y'all can't see, but I do have, let me see. Let me see how I can do it, y'all. I do have a lot of my Christmas back there. Starting it, I'm starting it, I'm starting it. Just want y'all to see. I don't have myself situated right today, but I'll get it hooked up. I'm gonna get it hooked up. I was looking real, real pale with these lights, y'all. Oh, I don't want to be too pale, but anyway. Um, how y'all doing this Sunday? I'm excited because I got a lot accomplished. Um, I promised myself I would not go to Dollar Tree this weekend. And I didn't because I needed to organize everything before Christmas, put everything where it needs to be. I needed to do um, make some wreaths for the outside of my house. I finished those. I'll put a picture in here for y'all. Um, what else did I do? Just a lot of organizing. Um, I want to get to do some, um, some DIYing. So I didn't shop because I got enough bags just to do hauls on what I have. Um, so I don't know, girl. I, I, it was hard. It was hard. Like I was like shaking, ready to go to Dollar Tree. I didn't know what to do. You know what I'm saying? I'm so used to doing that. I only do it on weekends. Well, I do do it on weekdays when I have the time. But on weekends, I'm definitely going out there. And I didn't do it, and I just feel like I'm missing something. Oh, ooh, but I had to woosa, and I got it right. So anyway, I want to come to you guys today. These glasses are giving me a little fit, as they always do. Make sure they're clean. I don't know, there's still kind of something on them, but anyway, it's all good. It's like a something on here, y'all, and it just won't come off. It's like a smudge. Anyway, we're going we gonna to plow through. Okay, I got my lipstick on today for y'all. Now, what I did was I used that um, Beauty Intuition. I'm a creature of habit. Once I get something that I like, I keep using it again and again and again. Um, this is the Beauty Intuition, the colors. And I can't remember if this was ruby red or mocha. Mm, it smells like chocolate. This is what I'm using. I think I showed you guys before. I love this. I don't know. I didn't have any problems with it. And then I put a little bit of gloss because I'm a glossy girl. Well, couldn't get it closed. I'm a glossy girl, so I put some old wet and wild on top of it. And that's where it is. Okay. Let me quit playing with y'all. Let's get into this haul. I got some Dollar Tree that I had, and I want to show you guys what I got before it just gets too old. Before that, <clears throat> I'm going to show you guys some friend mail that I received. And I'm so, so excited. Thank you, Annabelle. Love you, girl. If you guys have not watched Annabelle's channel, I'm putting her out here. Go check her out. She's almost hit a 1,000. And she's a sweet, sweet lady. She's been watching my channel forever. And she watches, I, I don't know whether she watched every video, but she probably has watched the most amount of my videos out of anybody. Um... And um, I really appreciate her for that because she doesn't have to do it, you know? So I love you, Annabelle. Thank you so much. And she sent me some surprise friend mail the other day. You got me, Annabelle. You got me. She's always getting me. Like, she sends me stuff right out of the blue. I'm not good at stuff like that. I, like, almost want to tell the person when I'm going to send them something. Anyway. So she sent me some surprise friend mail. And it's really cute. And I wanted to show you guys. So let's get into it. I'm going to show you guys what she sent me. It's in just a basic envelope. I didn't want to show anything because it has our addresses on it. And um, I'm just going to show you the items that were in there. And Annabelle, answer me in the comments. Did you make these or did you find these? Because these are really precious. And I do appreciate them. Um, look at this, you guys. She sent me this. Look how pretty that is. It's a rose, but it looks like it's like handmade. I don't know. She didn't put any, she didn't put a letter in there or anything. She just sent me these. But I love this. It's so pretty. Look how it changes color. Oh, I love it. So this is one thing she sent me. I'm thinking, I had this on my desk, um, but I'm thinking I would love to like put a, a, a pin on the back of here and then I could wear it like a pin. Isn't that pretty? Thank you, Annabelle. So that came in there. Got to sit it down so I don't want it to get messed up. And let me show you what else she sent me. I just don't know whether these are handmade or she got these from somewhere. Because it looks like she could have handmade these. Um, here's one. It's a keychain in that pretty purple color. Look at that, y'all. And see what it's made out of makes me think it's like resin. 
And I know Dollar Tree is doing those resin kits. So I'm wondering, did she make these? Um, I'm going to, you know, just let me know, uh, Annabelle. I mean, I think they're extra special anyway. I know this thing is crooked, y'all. I'm sorry. Um, I think they're extra special anyway, but I just wanted to see if you did. Because if you hand made these, I want to try. Look at this one, y'all. Oh, it's got like snowflakes and little red and green stars or something in there. Look at that one. Then it's got that little thing you can use it as a keychain. Look at that. You can put on a necklace. Like if I wanted to wear it for the holiday, I could put add this to a necklace. That would be really cute. And then she said another one. This one's like a pretty blue. Well, it looks like it's got purple mixed in there too. Like almost like a tie dye. It's got purple at the top and that pretty blue right there. Any one of these, like this is, a, you could use this as a keychain, but any one of these you could wear as a nifty like necklace. You could make it into a um, bracelet if you're hooking it onto a bracelet. Very pretty. Okay, and then this one, it has the snowflakes, but it's like blue and white. These are very, very pretty, Annabelle. I do appreciate it. I love them. <clears throat> and then this one, let me see. It's just got tons of colors. It's like glitter. Look at that one. Pretty. I'm so excited for them. I was like, I didn't expect it, you know? And it, the best presents are when you don't expect them. Here's another Christmas design. Looks like gold. Red, green, and white. Look at that. And the last one, which I thought was so cute. Um, these are like, I don't know what you call these. Is this yin and yang? Or it's not the peace sign. Like this, you guys. And that black and white. Oh, Annabelle, so I love them. Thank you so, 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 so much. I'm going to get you. You didn't tell me you were sending them. My husband just walks in the house and he goes, you got a package from Annabelle. And I'm like, Annabelle? I said, she didn't say anything. I'm like, I'm going to kill her. So, Annabelle, I will be doing something with all of these. I do appreciate it. I wanted to put that up. But Annabelle's very special, you guys. Please, 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 if you have not subscribed to her, go subscribe to her channel. Let me move that out of the way so none of it gets broken. Now, we're getting into the holiday spirit before we get into our haul. So, I had these headbands, you guys. I still have the tags on them from last year. I never got to wear them. So, guess what? We're going to wear them this year. And the first one we're going to put on, I don't know if these are Santas or elves or what. But we're going to put it over my headband. Yeah. Yes, Santa's coming to town. Santa coming to town. <laughs> I'm getting silly with it, y'all. Anyway. I have others because these were not, well, this one, I don't know, I, I more, may have wore this one last year, and then this one still has the tag on it, so I know I didn't wear that one. Love that with the sequins on it. I think I had this one out this year, too. But anyway, I'll put them to the side. So every time we do a video, we can have a different headband. I don't like that tag sticking out. I don't know, that's irritating me. Ugh. Okay, well, whatever, it's going to be that way for now. All right, y'all, let's get into the haul. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Again, we're trying to hit 3K by my birthday, which is December the 25th. It is a stretch, but we're going to make that stretch. Come on, come on. Share me out with all your family and friends. Tell everybody about that crazy, tell everybody about that crazy lady C. All right, now let's get into it, y'all. Um, I'm going to start off with some, um, I don't have any food to show you guys. I don't think, nope. So we're gonna start off with some toys. Um, I was showing you in my prior video that I had some of those squishy toy things that the kids are loving. Well, I also picked up these. These are called the Orb Stretchy Monkey. And they come in all different colors. And they are what they say they are. They're a stretchy monkey. Um, they're smushy and it says splat on them. They're made by Orb. And they feel more, actually these don't feel as squishy as they're... These feels like feel like a um like a sandbag like a you know a sandbag it feels like it has sand inside of it so I picked up the purple one now I think I will send these to my grandkids they might enjoy these um it's for ages three plus whoops for ages three plus so I had another one yeah I picked up the purple 
I guess he's black. And I think I have another one, y'all. And then I picked up the brown. So the brown, one of them may be a donation because I only need two for my grandsons. So one of them may be a donation. But they had the brown, the black, and the purple. They're pretty. They're really heavy, too. So I picked them up. I've been doing stuff all day, you guys, so I'm tired. I was cooking Sunday dinner. We made a roast. That's almost done. In the, um, I just added the veggies to that. Man, I was doing my reefs. I was organizing. I was doing a lot. But anyway, so here's more toys, y'all. Um, I finally, finally found, I have been searching for these so hard because people are really liking these for the kids. This is the kitchen play set um, by Just Pretending. I love the Just Pretending items. Um, kitchen fun and it's for ages three plus and it's got that burger look at that the burger it's got the um excuse me you guys the flipper I can't even think and then it's got french fries and then you get the frying pan look at that when I got these in the um Dollar Tree the cashier had never seen these I'm like how does she never see these she was like oh I'm gonna go get some of those for my grandkids I was like yeah they're gonna love that go pick it up a dollar twenty five so I picked that one up. These are the only two. I might have another one. Okay, these are the only three. Well, I might have more. But anyway, these are the only two with the actual big frying pan that I found. And this one is, I'm guessing this is pancakes, bacon, and eggs. And you get a spatula with that one too. So these are the two I found by Just Pretend. So cute. And like I said in my prior video, you guys, if you spend the money on that kitchen set, come out and buy these for $1.25 and your kids can cook all day. Because I know sometimes the kitchen sets, they come with pieces like that, but they may not come with a lot. So, you know. I found this. This is the Just Pretending Kitchen Play Set. Um, this one is ages three plus. And this looks like they're making a cheese sandwich. And it comes with a pat, I mean a Lord, it comes with a um, pan, the bread, the cheese, a knife, and a spatula. I thought that was adorable. So, of course, I picked that one up, too. Let's break it up a little bit. I picked up this dollhouse because I thought it was cute that it came with. It says dollhouse. It's not really a dollhouse. It's the um, play pieces for the dollhouse, and then it comes with a doll. So I thought this was cute. It comes with the TV and the entertainment center. Got the speakers on the side. And then it comes with the couch. And then you got your lamp. And you got your doll baby. I thought that was so cute. Now, I would pretend all day with these. I was a big, big pretender. I loved Barbie. Oh, this just brings back memories. I love getting, like, little kits like this with all the little pieces. Man, that was so much fun. Anyway, so I picked that up. And then let's go into little boy mode. Um, they had the construction drill play set. It has realistic sound and motion. Ages three plus. I don't really have to put batteries because I don't hear nothing. And it comes with the little pieces. Pick that up. Like these toys are the bomb. Like, I mean, come on, y'all. Kids will play all day. Then the last um, pretendable is the sliceable food set. I have another one that I picked up that had the fruits. That was in my prior video. This one has the veggies. You get a carrot and two pieces of broccoli. You get a knife and a cutting board. And that is so cute for the kitties. They're going to love it. Um, I did have one food item, but I'll show you guys that in a minute. Let's move this stuff over. I picked up the, um, oh God, Blippy, Mr. Blippy. I picked up some of his um, body wash. But then I saw the trolls. Now, the one I wanted, I think, for the trolls actually had the hair on it. I have seen that nowhere. I've seen it in somebody's haul, but I've seen it in none of my stores. But this is the Trolls um, Trolls Band Together by DreamWorks. It's the three-in-one body wash, shampoo, and conditioner. And this is popping strawberry scented, and it's eight fluid ounces. And I don't know whether I'll give this to my grandkids or it'll be a donation, but I thought this was a great buy. $1.25. I found a cute book that I probably will give to my grandkids. This one, it says questions and answers for science. Explore how things work. 
pretty cute, y'all. They always have good books at Dollar Tree. This book, it is a Dollar Tree book, so it has no price on it, you know. Let's see. But it, it's really cool. It has all these different, like, let me show you. The Origin of Life. And it shows all that. And then it goes on to Matter. You know, it's just things that, you know, I used to like to read books like this. I was a nerd. So for me, it was pretty cool. Um, yeah, it talks about heat. So this is a pretty good book, um, you know, for the kids. So I picked that up. Um, let me show you guys the one food item that I had that I forgot I had. Now, these have been out before, but they're back again. And I'm very excited because I like to donate these. And this is a huge General Mills family size. I hop mini pancake cereal, blueberry and syrup. Love finding family size cereals. I bought two of these um, for the donations. And this is good until March of 2024. You cannot beat that, okay? You cannot beat it with a baseball bat. If you need it for your family, it's family size. If you don't, donate it. And this is a large box of cereal for a family in need. So I picked that up. And I put these to the side, y'all. Okay, let's get into some health and beauty. Yeah, then we, then we got Christmas. And then I think we can close it up. Um, I may have, I have some more, but I'll save it all. I found these, these are, these I didn't even know I had. They were in a bag and I think they got lost. So it's been a while since I've had these. These are the Fresh Start scrunchies and you get five pieces. I love getting five like hair items for $1.25. These are really, really cute, pretty colors. I think I got these back in the summer. That's why it's these colors. Um, but yeah, this is really nice. If you want to stick this in a gift basket for Christmas for a little girl that you know, put some other hair items. It'd be a really good gift. And it's by, it's, I mean, it's a scrunchie. So, so I'll put, pick that up. And let's, since we're into hair items, let's pull some of these hair items out. Now, my girl, sweet Sadie J. Hey, Sadie. Hey, sis. For those of you who don't know her, subscribe to her channel. She's great, great, great. Um, I think it's her that has this, this um, headband. But I had been looking for one that was that leather look. And I could not find it. And I finally, finally found this. I think this would be so cute with a, like, a leather look outfit. Oh, don't hurt them now. That would be so pretty. But it's like a braided look, but it's leather. And now that I look at this, hmm. Okay, it looks like it's okay. The bottom of this feels funny. I don't know. It should be all right. Um, but it just says headband, and that's it. But I thought this was really, really cute. I'm, I'm loving headbands. Y'all know how I do. Um, it feels funny to me. Okay. So that's that. Then I think it's Sadie or someone else. Sadie wears a lot of the headbands. So that's why I'm thinking it's her. Um, this one is so pretty. I wish this was in like a leather look because it would be so pretty. Um, this is just like, um, like ribbon feels like. But look at those colors and the design. Oh my goodness. Um, so cute, y'all. So I picked this up too. You can match this with so many outfits, like for real. So I picked that one up. I'm um, trying to see if I have any more. I think that's it for the headwear. Okay, now we're just going to move on to everything else, right? I finally, 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 you guys, I was looking for it so hard. I didn't know what to do with myself. I finally found the limited edition um, chapstick pumpkin pie. Chapstick pumpkin pie. And it has the three pack. You know you've been seeing everybody with these and I could not find them. I ran into them and I had to pick up two. So I picked up two packs of those. I will be putting these in everybody's stocking. Um, then I had the hard candy. It's 90851 Lavender Color Correct Expert Stick. It's new and it says corrects, full, corrects dullness and neutralizes Sallowness, medium to dark skin tones. Hey, it's new. I had never seen it before. I was going to pick it up. Now, I usually like hard candy, so hopefully this will be good. 
Okay, let's move on to these. Let me see how many. Oh, you know what? I got some more headwear. I tell you, I'm just doing some things today. Okay. I had already showed you guys that I think I already showed you that. I, I must have got two. I think I already had the Fruit Loop Scented Bath Bomb. It's one bath bomb and it's 1.41 ounces. These are good, good stocking stuffers. Or if you're making a, ba a gift basket for somebody, you put this in there with a scrubby and some body wash and wonderful basket. So I picked the Fruit Loops up. I picked up the Doritos. Now, me and my daughter both gasped when we saw this because we're like, Doritos body bath bomb? That's gross. But of course, it's not. It doesn't smell like Doritos. It says Doritos Cool Ranch, but it's a wild blue raspberry scented bath bomb. So make, you know, don't think it smells like Doritos because it doesn't. Pick that one up. I picked up this one. This one is the Cheetos Crunchy and it's orange scented. So I picked up all three of those. I think I have another one that's a double. And then I picked these up because I just thought they were so cute. And it says you can use them for your bath and shower. It says body raves for bath and shower. Um... Yeah, it's 3.5 ounces, and I just thought these were so pretty. So you can use these in your bath or your shower. Um, bath bomb. It doesn't say how to put it in your shower, but it says on the front, it says bath or shower. So I guess I, you just throw it in there some kind of way. But these are so pretty. And then I got this one. This one's strawberry fizz, and this one's super berry. These just make such a good addition to a gift. Or if you're making a gift basket, they are just going to be so cute. So I picked those up. Now, I had another piece of headwear that I forgot to show you guys. I love it, love it, love it so much because I am a plaid fan. This is the headband that everybody's been showing. Look at that. Look at that. You're going to look like a schoolgirl. Look at that, y'all. It's so cute. And it's so soft. Ooh, yeah. I don't know. I would like to have like a tan outfit with this tan in it, like for the winter, you know, for the fall, whatever. I like wearing tan boots um, with a pair of jeans and like this tan color shirt and put this on your head, man, you're going to be cute. So I picked that up. Um, I also, I had passed this by many times, you guys. This is the Blistex Lip, ugh, I cannot talk. This is the Blistex Lip Medics. Relieves sore lips and restores moisture balance. And they had these, so I picked that up. This was for me, <laughs> so I only bought one. <laughs> All right. I picked these up for hubby or my brother-in-law. I don't know who I can use it for. These are the Mechanic Wear Speed Knit 360 Cut Resistant High Abrasion and Touch Screen Compat Capable. Um, they're gloves. So I thought these were so cute. I got them in the green. They had them like in green, red. I don't know. They might have had black. Did I show you guys? Yeah, I showed you the Cheetos already. I'm losing my mind. Then we're going to move on. Let me see. I think the only thing I have left, you guys, is Christmas. And that's what we're going to talk about. So let me move some of this mess out the way. And we're going to get into Christmas. I've already started decorating my house. As you guys can see. Um, I'll put in some pics of what I've already done because I've done a little bit. I ain't done everything, but I've done a little bit. Um, this is a felt garland I got from Dollar Tree. It's six pieces, and this one was Santa. And they had other ones that had different things on them. Um, I just wanted to get Santa, so I picked him up. Then I picked this up. These are just decorative bells. You can put them wherever. Um, they do have little strings on them, and they're in just red and green. I love red and green. Those are my favorite colors for Christmas. I'm very, very basic. You get 16 of these. So I have small trees, like I have the little Dollar Tree trees, um, and then I have a four-foot tree. That's all we're going to put up this year. Normally, I put up one large tree, like a regular large tree. I put up the four-foot tree, and I put up my two Dollar Tree trees. We will not be home for Christmas this year, so I'm only going to put up my four-foot one, and I'm going to put my two Dollar Tree trees next to them, and that's going to be at it. Hubby's going to elevate them, and we're going to have them out of our front window so everybody can see them. We're going to light them up, elevate them, because um, we normally put our big tree in our front window and light it up. But we're not going through all that no more. The kids aren't here. 
um, you know, we have no grandkids coming over to see it. It's really more just for us. So we, we just want to chill and mellow. You know, we're not going to be home. We just want to have a little bit of festivity. So that's what we're going to do. But anyway, I said all that to say. These would look cute on my little Dollar Tree trees. Um, so I picked those up. I also picked these up. I thought they would be cute on my Dollar Tree trees. Or, since I'm trying to make a gingerbread house, I could break these off and use them on my gingerbread house. These are decorative Christmas card garland. It's called decorative Christmas card garland kit. I don't know, but they look like Christmas trees to me. And they have the little clippies on the back. Um, you could put these onto presents because they have that clip. You could use these on presents. You could use these on a lot of things. I thought they were cute, so I picked them up. I mean, some things um, I basically... Um, organize everything to where I put like things that you can do DIYs or put on the trees. I put them in a separate bag because I never know what I'm going to use for something. I might just dig around in the bag and say, oh, these are cute. Let's put them on this. So it just depends on how I feel that day. All right. All right, y'all. So let's move on. I've got a package over here. I'm so excited. I had to bring it to y'all. And I know y'all going to be like, oh, we seen that already. But guess what? It took me a long time to find it. Y'all going to see it today. Um, it took me so long to find these, you guys. And then when I did find them, they didn't have the full set. So, this is that new dinnerware set with the evergreens on it. I fell in love with this, you guys, the minute I saw it. I don't care. I love it. I mean, the quality of it. Look at that. It's got a good hold for my tea. I'm not a coffee drinker. For the holidays, I think I might be drinking some coffee, though. Um, because I got a lot of those, um, oh, I can't think of the name. You guys know those special coffees they had that Keurig and then they had them in the bag. Harry and David. They had the Harry and David coffee. So I may have to put my Harry and David coffee in here. Yes, with some special things in it and drink it like that. I love these mugs, okay? Look at that. So I picked up, I think I only, well, it was very limited because everybody grabbed them up. Um... I think I bought two. So I bought two of the mugs. I didn't buy any of the glassware because they did have the glassware, but my cabinets are so full, you guys. I, I, I just couldn't do it. But the glassware is cute. I will put a picture in here, you guys. I'm going to try to pull a picture from the website to show you what the other glassware and the full set looks like. But I don't have space in my home. I honestly don't to put another piece of glassware. I barely have room to put another plate. Um, and that's probably why when I got there, you guys, the only plate left was this. And this isn't even one of the larger plates. This is like a salad plate, but it fit, actually works for me because I have all the other sets from all the other years and I didn't need it, but I just love this pattern so much. I had to have it. I wanted to just have a piece of it. So I've got this, that was the only plate left. And then I got the two mugs. And somehow, some way, I will display this, you guys. And I'll show you when I do. So that's the end of that. But I just had to show you because I finally found it. It took me a long while. Um, I don't think I ever found it in my area. Like, I'm in Maryland, and I never saw it in Maryland at all. Maybe if I go out to the stores now, they may have it. Um, but before Thanksgiving, no. And then I had to go all the way to Emporia, thanks to um, Sadie J., because I knew she had been finding a lot of things in Emporia. Couldn't remember whether she found that plate set. So I said, well, we'll take a chance on, on the way home. We stopped in Emporia, Virginia, and they had it. And I was so excited. So that's why you should watch other people's channels, find out where they're finding good things at, and you too may be able to find something. Um, the last of what we got, you guys, are these two. These are for my daughters. I knew they would love the blingy blingy of it all. They do have stockings already, but this is just something. I may hang these up at my house, um, but they're really, really cute, and I like them. And that's it for tonight, you guys. Um, I got to go check my roast. Um, that's about it for now. Again, thank you, Annabelle, for being a friend. You will have something good coming to you for Christmas, girl. Um, I'll be talking at you guys later. Please stay safe, you guys. Stay blessed, and I will see you in the next one. Smooches. Bye-bye, y'all.